Hey there welcome to my YouTube channel, subscribe to my channel and also press this bell icon. How to deal with cracked or bleeding nipples. What are cracked nipples? When you begin breastfeeding, it is quite common to experience tenderness in your nipples. While a burning and stinging sensation, coupled with aches, is perfectly normal, cracked, bleeding or sore nipples may need a doctor's attention. Signs and Symptoms of Sore or Cracked Nipples If your nipples are red, pointy and sore after every feeding, instead of being round and smooth, you may need to consult your doctor or a lactation expert. Causes of Cracked Nipples Number 1. Incorrect Latching Sore nipples may develop if the baby is not latching on to the breasts correctly. Changing the way the baby latches might fix the problem. Number 2. Dry skin or eczema on breast detergents on clothes, irritants from perfumes, soaps, creams and lotions, dry air due to the usage of air conditioners, coolers and heaters can cause eczema. This can lead to soreness of nipples. Number 3. Incorrect use of a breast pump Incorrect use of a breast pump can cause injury to your breast tissue and lead to bleeding or cracked nipples. Number 4. Thrush. This is a yeast infection on the skin of the nipple that can also lead to soreness. The infection can also occur inside your baby's mouth. Number 5. Tongue tie in baby. If your baby has a tongue tie, he will face difficulties in feeding and tend to push the nipples with their tongue. This can lead to painful nipples and discomfort. Treatment for cracked or sore nipples. Number 1. Correcting baby latching. Number 2. Applying creams. Number 3. Avoiding soaps and lotions. Managing cracked nipples. Before breastfeeding. Wash your hands sit comfortably and relax. To help milk flow, you can apply a warm washcloth to the breast and massage it gently. If you have painful or cracked nipples, you can consider expressing the milk and feeding the baby. During breastfeeding, ensure that the baby latches onto your breast correctly. Ideally, the baby should take at least one inch of the areola into his mouth. If you feel uncomfortable after 30 seconds, take the baby off and allow them to relatch. To break the baby's suction, put your finger in the corner of their mouth gently, as pulling them off can cause injury. After breastfeeding, First check if nipples are red. Wipe the breasts with clean water and allow them to dry. If you are using breast pads, change them frequently. Ensure you wear a well-fitting bra to support protects the breasts. Apply breast milk on your nipples and around the nipples. Air dry your nipples. Home remedies for cracked nipples. Express a little milk onto the nipple and allow it to air dry. The antibacterial properties of breast milk heal sore nipples. Use an ice pack before you feed the baby. This numbs the nipple as you latch the baby on and is one of the easiest remedies for cracked nipples. Oil massage. Massaging with warm oil moisturizes the affected area keeping the skin supple and healthy by reducing dryness. Oils like olive oil, sweet almond oil and coconut oil are effective in moisturizing the area and boosting the healing process. Preventive methods for cracked nipples. 
monitoring baby's hunger cues and feeding them on a timely basis will make it easier for the baby to get a good latch every time. A very hungry baby might grab the nipple, causing more pain. So, allowing the baby time to learn and latch effectively can prevent the occurrence of cracked nipples. When to contact a doctor While it is normal to have sore and cracked nipples during breastfeeding, a little blood and milk will not harm the baby. If you can bear the pain, it is advisable to continue to breastfeed the baby. Make sure that you consult your doctor if it gets too painful and unbearable for you. Do not wait for the condition to worsen. Consult your doctor if your cracked nipples don't heal soon enough. Thank you for watching. Subscribe for more.